Hey friends, in James chapter 3, uh, James begins a new topic, and he says this, Not many of you should presume to be teachers, my brothers, because you know that we who teach will be judged more strictly. We all stumble in many ways. If anyone's never at fault in what he says, he's a perfect man able to keep his whole body in check. Don't you wish you could, <laughs> don't you wish you could uh, be perfect in what you say? And what comes out of your mouth. We'll look at that further in uh, the days ahead, you know, the importance of being careful about what you say. And, and none more so than teachers need to take care in this area. He says, verse 1, not many of you should presume to be teachers, my brothers, because you know that we who teach will be judged more strictly. Um, I don't know that I want to be judged more strictly than everyone else, but it's part of the Part of the responsibility of a teacher to make sure you get it right. Uh, it, you know, and, and when I stand before God, I, I know that I haven't gotten it all right. I've tried. I've tried. But, but the important thing is to be faithful to the Lord and to take it seriously because he takes it seriously. And, and especially for, for all of us, you know, whatever we say and whatever comes out of our mouth, but especially for those who uh, are teachers, and especially, I think, even beyond just those who are teachers, those who are called to be servants of God as ministers, as missionaries. I mean, people are listening, and it's impacting their lives, and we will be judged more severely. And we need to hold uh, tenaciously to the truths of God's Word and seek for forever and for always to bend our knees and our thoughts and our desires to those of his, that we might clearly proclaim Christ in his word and not ourselves in our opinions. So again, whether it be me or someone else, when you're hearing someone especially teaching the word of God, uh, listen carefully, look deeply into the word, and, and, and to study to see whether the things that teacher is saying are, are true or not, because God's word is the absolute uh, reference point for all truth. And only as teachers accurately reflect that and teach that are they accurately proclaiming the word of God. Think about these things. <laughs> and be afraid, but be encouraged.